I sought pleasure with the silver I received from the Order. I shared it too, with many in need. Don't be blinded by the gleam of your bloodlust. Shared silver always comes at a cost. What of it? I forged good from what you call evil. Lives were improved. Lives worth more than the silver that paid for them. I do not regret the lives lost for the charity gained. have worn thin. I am no longer the reed among shields, the glimmer blood, the hallowed skull crack, the scourge of swan ropes, the iron thong, the lender of silver gowns. I only wish to be a freebooter, someone who writes their own destiny. Be glad you head to Valhalla with a poem on your lips. Bow to this, but you will not unearth us all. You will not dig deeply enough. We are both a clot and cancer. We sit heavy in water, and yet we spread like a river's current. Are you well? Why would you ask such a question at such a time as this? Beneath your words is something of a size unknown, a mystery. It lurks behind every frail word from your mouth. to the Orther. It keeps people well placed. It is not truth, but true power. You desecrate the very purpose of life. No. No, no. I place power on power. The great becomes greater. You will see. told everyone he was Christian. He was not. He was one of us. He only wanted the silver and the swords for his men of mercy. And you have kept his tradition going? Without flinching. Without hesitating. Offa would be proud of me. You must have seen 100 summers, old man. It feels thus. your biscuits. Do you give them to your children? I would not let good food go to waste. I would let my children starve. A serpent's gift will always end in malice. Sweet from evil remains sweet, even if it crumbles quickly in their hands.
wish my life had been a carnival of drinking ale and pissing. It could have been, I'm sure. No, we have not reached such a point. I used the order to live a life of ale drinking, but the price of my ale was murder. Sad, really. I serve the young Athelred. He will rise one day. He is no Elfred, from what I hear. I lie to everyone, and they will never know. They will tell stories of me as a good man who served his lord. Your Huga walks with a new beast. I was building a boat to carry my family to safety one day. And what of the orphans you left behind? Do they get a boat? A brigade of bastards. They are the only ones left ruling England. My people were of the Wiccan Kingdom. Now we are ruled by Christ-beaten bastards. These hidden ones, is that who you slave for? I slave for none. I'm scrubbing England clean of its filth for the safety of my people. Ah, uh, listen. Do you hear? The excuses of a mind enslaved. <laughs> The first man I killed for my order, I cried and wept after trying to hold back the tears. But I told myself, I am merely acting upon a foretold destiny, navigating the whim of greater gods. My actions are simply pebbles. Pebbles that wash away in the surf as harmless as dust. Pebbles were once bedrock. As were you. And the families who fell by the Order's command? Were they not worthy of love? You are a Dane. How can you speak of the value of a life? All are ranked as less than the acts to you. Not true. I see honor in many people, many places. You have proved here that your compassion has a hard and brutal limit. 